Okay, it is approximately 15 feet off that fence panel and 22 feet across, but we're gonna go a foot off that fence panel and a foot off here. So it's actually, a, it's, well, 14 and a half, 15 from here and then 20 across. We're going to move the paver to the other side of the fence. Any extra will haul away. We are gonna have a turn down here about a foot and a half because there just is. And we're also gonna do a half circle, about four inch, four foot diameter, but he's gonna decide once he decides what kind of fire pit he wants, but we're just gonna do a four inch wide outline of a circle and then dig a little hole for him to basically be able to recess the fire pit in. Uh, we're gonna do a diagonal three foot walk here to there. And then from this step to where the joint would be here, three feet, and from here, that way, four feet. He's okay with us basically doing on grade, trimming that back up so that way we can basically just put the forms on the ground. We're gonna go about a foot off here and then it's four foot wide, like I said, from there to there and then uh, it'll connect to the driveway. We're gonna also get all this grass in between it and the house so he can do a mulch area while we're at it. We're gonna bury, um, probably a two inch PVC pipe, something that can slide that through across here. So that way if in the future he wants to adjust it, he can. We're gonna bury a piece of pipe here and one over there. So that way if that one fails, he can tie it in later. And we'll go ahead and just tie that one in. It's just gotta get past the uh, sidewalk. You want me to close your gate for you? I'm sorry? You want me to close your gate? Oh, please.